My husband and I would like to wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and we thought we'd do a review of 2015. The snow dominated our lives this winter. We had over 15 feet of it so we spent most of the winter just shoveling. I know, my back's still sore. Mm -hmm. Carol got a new hobby this year. We started going to au auctions back in January and she took a long, long time to realise that she didn't have to stick her hand up for everything that was for sale. It's so tempting though. It is. But we got some bargains. 2015 was also the year of firsts. I went cross-country skiing, uh, mainly because we bought some cross-country skis from an auction and then I went camping, although it wasn't really camping because I did stay in a luxury trailer for a couple of nights and also I went fishing and caught a fish. What caught a fish was it? A flounder. Flounder. I could have it? not answered that and left you floundering for a moment but, <laughs> but it was a flounder. Yeah. And I spent the summer working at the rocks again. It was a fantastic year at the rocks. We had record-breaking numbers. Um, we had all sorts of fun and games and excitement with coach loads of Chinese people fighting their way up and down the stairs and taking photographs every other step. It was great fun. And then at the end of the year, we had a certain visitor from the UK, Dame Esther Ranson, who I got to meet for the first time. First Dame I've ever met. Ooh. Well, part of a pantomime Dame, but they don't count. May saw Ali graduate. We went over to the island to watch her graduation, so that was fun. And then in June, we had the excitement of Moncton being the centre of the, the focus for the world of sport as the Women's World Cup was played in, well, not just Moncton, but in Canada. And Moncton was one of the host cities. And Ali and I went to see England play France, which was tremendously exciting. Great performance by the England ladies, I thought. I thought it was very, very nice to see an England team play with a bit of pride and a bit of passion and a bit of belief. The men could learn a thing or two from them, I say. My friend Nita went and she learnt the rules of football. She's actually calling it football now as well instead of soccer. Does she understand offside? Probably better than I do. But uh... Anyway, we um, had a few days away on the, on the island, uh, which was very nice. And we did a tour of a microbrewery. We did. Which Paul enjoyed. I did. <laughs> also, um, back in October, I went back to the UK and caught up with... Uh, a few people. So I hope you enjoyed our very quick run through of the exciting things that we've had here in the Harris household in 2015. And it just, just leaves me to say on behalf of Carol, myself and Ali and Darcy, we wish you all a very, very Merry Christmas. And uh, we hope you have a healthy, happy and prosperous 2016. We'd also be interested to know whether you like this video blog or whether you'd prefer us to go back to the old blog. Comments would be appreciated. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Bye.